had a question from a landlord asking, can I take what I want from my tenant's deposit? And the answer to that is no, you can't. Even if the tenant has wrecked your property, there is a legal process that you have to follow. So initially, if you are self-managing, the tenant's deposit should have been placed in a registered scheme. And that should even be done by your agent if they're managing it on your behalf. Then what will happen is you will need to provide evidence to the deposit protection scheme and they will clarify if, what they're able to give you back and they'll distribute the funds. But never ever take it upon yourself as a landlord just to hold the deposit and then think, well, the tenants wrecked my carpet or they've wrecked my sofa and I'm going to take the money back from them. That can cause a lot of problems in the long run. And unfortunately, there is often a case where tenants are favoured when you go into the legal system, especially where deposits are concerned. You, should, you need to always, always make sure that that deposit is protected. Always follow the correct route. Always keep all of your invoices, any of your receipts for anything that you've paid for in the property. Keep photographic evidence, keep inspections up to date, and that's the best way that you'll be able to retain what you need to retain from that tenant's deposit.